accused of recording the sexual assault of a teenager and posting it online. The first trial against Yarelis Cespedes ended in a mistrial. Now she's on trial a second time. News 13's Dean Staley reports the state called on the victim to testify. Had a tendency of lying about her age. My client was barely 18. After you hear all the evidence, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, it will be clear that the defendant made this video and shared the video. That defendant is Yarlis Cespedes, accused of recording video of a 13-year-old being sexually assaulted, then sharing that video online. The victim took the stand first. And, uh, Who is holding that light? The defense claims Cespedes didn't know the victim was underage, but the victim says the two celebrated her 13th birthday, would hang out with middle school friends, and... Are you claiming that Yarelis would force you to lie about your age? Yeah, of course, me too, but she would come and she was old so I was young and I would follow her. The victim says she was assaulted in November of 2018. In opening arguments, the defense claimed Cespedes was trying to protect the victim, but also teach her a lesson. My client decides that because she felt that she was out of control uh, and doing stuff that she shouldn't be doing, pull her phone out so she can show what she had been doing the night before. The victim has a different story. Did she ever tell you that you were acting badly? No. Did she ever say anything to you after the video was taken that she was going to show you the, that recording to show your bad behavior? No. Dean Staley, KRQE News 13. Suspedis is being held through trial after the state tried four times to keep her locked up. Pre-trial detention was granted after she was arrested in a shoplifting case. This trial is scheduled to end on Thursday.